can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, Jim. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven foot Kareem at the bar to stay undefeated. Right. If you could do that, you could do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once. I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, Bruce Lee, in a nutshell. Just so wise. Bruce Lee, ladies and gentlemen, Bruce effing Lee steps inside the octagon and is ready to fight. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. All right, now for the official introductions. We go inside the octagon where we find Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, Bruce the Dragon Lee! Herb Dean, third Herb party in the octagon right. tonight. Right. All right, well, there is something undeniably intoxicating about this Yaz Island in Abu Dhabi, and we have got a great UFC live event for you here tonight inside the walls of the Etihad Arena, which opened its doors not all that long ago in 2021. Yeah, it hasn't been open long, but big moments have happened. And you can tell the excitement of the crowd every time we fight here in Abu Dhabi. It's a tremendous environment, and the fights have always lived up to the expectation. Nice kick, yep. Right on the button. Trying to establish the jab early on here. Massive head kick. Nice punch there by Lee. Partially blocked. Nice body shot. Sidekick lands for him there, champ. A lot of times that is used to manage space. Oh, nice. And he's bleeding from the mouth, Daniel. Looks as though there's a cut on his lip. Thankfully, he's a lot tougher than I am. Push kick there to the body. Gets in close and gets that single collar tie locked in tight. Clean with the right hook. Under three minutes now to go in the round. Oh, effective strike there by Lee. He's doing a really good job of getting on that high crotch and just following the action. Side control now, DC. A lot of options at his disposal from here. Inside control, you got a ton of options. He goes knees on belly. He's postured up. He's landed big ground and pound. He has to move on the bottom or the fight's going to get stopped. Now inside the closed guard. And he's going to try to find ways to pass and move to a submission. And he's able to work his way back to his feet. Ooh, what a punch. Let me see some Just over two minutes to go in round one. I want to see it overhead. Quick jab. We can do this, come on. 
one was Back and forth we go! Ooh, head kick lands and he's hurt. Going to the body now with the kick. That one is blocked, though, by Lee. Oh, nice. out of range with that punch attempt. All right, so a good series of kicks by him there. He has mixed it up beautifully, I think, on the feet tonight. He is kicking everywhere tonight. He's doing a fantastic job. Oh, head kick blocked, though, by Lee. 45 seconds remain in the round. Oh, really good with the kick to the body. Misses with the right hand. So we cross the 30-second mark in our opening round. Under 20 seconds now to go. Big body kick. Well, these fighters did not come to play defense tonight. Back and forth we go. Working on that. All right, there's the end of the round. Right, Lee's corner now. We'll take a look at that lip. The cut man is in, and you got to tighten that up. It's really starting to bleed now. We'll see if uh, it rears its ugly head as this fight continues. All right, let us now take a look back at some of the highlights from that previous round. We'll see if we can isolate the exact strike that caused that cut to his lip. He landed a beautiful shot that cut him on the lip. Now, listen, guys. As long as it ain't like Jarzinho rolled the strike and Alistair over oh. it, you're fine. Cuts on the lip are okay, unless your lip is hanging off, like we have seen sometimes. Ready. That is not Ready. that, but he's got to protect. I got Robbie Waller on line one, by the way. Oh, yeah. I, yeah, I remember about Robbie. Lip cuts. Oh, my God. I was thinking about that. I couldn't remember who it was. Though. All right, next round is upon us. Let's see how it plays out. All right, next round is now underway. Hopefully, the action continues at a high level. Pretty good first five minutes. Pretty good first five minutes. Both of them can really pick it up. Let's see who decides they're going to lead the dance as we go forward. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Well, he's got a pretty good sidekick, and you saw it right there. He did it great, and it pushed his opponent back. Notice how it creates space and allows him to get back to where he's coming from. Oh, roundhouse kick. Hard shots landing on both sides here. Good punch lands. Well, Champ, I don't see that well, but it's hard to miss the redness underneath that elbow. A lot of bodily investment from his opponent tonight. Yeah, it's an investment. John, it may not pay dividends right now, but the more you go there, the more damage you do eventually, it will show itself. Right now, it's starting to show. Use the left! Use the left! Just out of range with the straight left hand. All right, so he continues to land a high volume of strikes. He talked to us a lot about pace and pressure, and he has certainly kept up his end of the bargain. I mean, the cardio is fantastic tonight. He is pushing at a level that we have not seen him fight before. This is shades of Kobe Covington, Max Holloway, those guys that can fight all night. He is showing you that he has done the work in the training room, and it's on full display tonight. Effective with the jab. Under three minutes now to go on the round. Right oh, good power with a short shot to the head in the clinch. I mean, over and over, he is taking these strikes to the head. 
Well, a really good second round for him thus far. After a somewhat lackluster first round, he has found the rhythm and found his striking range. Scary proposition for the opponent now here in round two. Clean punch. Good lead right by Lee. Two minutes now to go in round two. Oh, man, the blood is flowing now. I know a lot of you like that, but he has got to figure some things out defensively or this fight's going to end. He's got to move his head, John. But the problem Let is go. now he's got Let the go. blood to deal with. He's got a sharp striker in front of him. He has got a lot of things to deal with if he wants to win this fight. But right now... The focus needs to be on the head movement so you're not getting hit in that cut. Well, he continues to stay busy and he continues to land with volume punches here. I mean, volume, but he's not wasting anything. He's so accurate out there. Man, look at the redness now almost immediately on the right side of his body. Offense is on the menu tonight. Back and forth we go. Nice punch to the head. Under a minute now to go. Strike. Oh, man, his leg kicks are outstanding, and you saw a great example of that just there. And you see his opponent starting to slow down. He cannot take many of those kicks. Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. Oh, and he lands yet another strike to the body. Pinpoint placement right underneath the elbow. Bleeding now. Nasty cut on his nose. 20 seconds left. Oh, good sequence there. The right hand followed by the left. Seconds winding down in round two. All right, so there's the end of the round. You see the blood trickling down as he makes his way back to the stool. Cut on the bridge of the nose, or so it appears from the strike in that round. Cut man getting right to work. All right, so now we have some real adversity. There's a cut on the nose. Hard to know if that's impacting the breathing, but some definite damage in that previous round. Yeah, some real damage. And now when you get a cut like that, that is in a bad spot. Because every time you get hit on the nose, it's so jarring and then the blood starts to go down into the mouth. He's got an uphill battle ahead of him. You ready to fight? Ready. Third yeah. round underway. All right, another round is now underway. Pretty good previous two rounds. We'll see who makes the requisite adjustments now moving forward. The adjustments are going to be the key, John. When you're doing everything you're trained to do, and it stays this close, you gotta really switch it up. Wood Corner was able to relay that message to their fighter better in between rounds. Well, we got a lot of blood now, ladies and gentlemen. I think my mother just turned off the TV, but every time that area gets targeted, that cut is getting worse and closer, theoretically, to the end of the fight. Yeah, and, you know, when you got a person like this in front of you that is so good at what they do, when you are bleeding like this and the work is showing, you got to try to find a way to stop them. He needs to try to get a takedown or something because the more he's standing, the more he's going to have to deal with this cut. And now, all the blood that's coming from the cut. Well, this fight's been pretty crazy thus far. Both guys doling out a lot of damage, and neither seems too bothered by it, but clearly both parties are hurt. Both guys are hurt. Both guys are fighting beautifully. Both oh, that's, that's, that's you, you don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Nice leg kick. All right, well, he rocked him pretty good, but he didn't sort of smell blood in the water, and now his opponent's back in the fight. I mean, blood's in the water. You got to go and get it. You got to go find the finish. You cannot get off the hook like that. 
because now he will be motivated to try to go and hurt you as you hurt him. What a fun fight between two guys that only focus on offense. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more Oh, what an offering up over the top. This fight's gonna be over, DC. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high when his opponent thought he was going low, and now he's got him hurt very badly. His nose is all cooking, it's all beat up, it's bleeding. He got hurt bad. That nose looks broken. Now lands a kick to the body. That's some power there. So we have crossed the midpoint in this one. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting them up now. Great commitment to the kicking game. Nice job by him defensively there. Lee gets caught by that straight punch. He Shot finds the target there. Great shot lands. Now he's got to go find that follow-up attempt. The kill shot is what they call it to go and end the fight. Oh, another strike to the torso right there. Got to get better defensively or that's going to be a real factor as this fight continues. He's got to tuck that elbow. Yeah. I mean, he's got that elbow flaring. And every time his opponent's going right up under and landing, right to the body. He's got to do something different right now or he's going to get to a point where he will not be able to continue this fight. He passes to half guard. A lot of top pressure being applied here as he works out of side control. Drops inside that close guard, DC. Full guard. Let's see how patient he is as he attacks a submission or big ground and pound. Short time now in the round. All right, so you got to be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't want to mess around for too long. Lee's back in full guard. Well, an incredible fight thus far. Both fighters look like they could be finished at any time. If you wondered about the heart on either side, that question is answered to Nothing. There are no more questions in regards to these two fighters. Both of these men have been hurt. Both of these men are swollen. They're bloody. They're both, even though them, they're both willing and ready to continue this fight. 20 seconds now remain in the round. Tries to take out the leg. Beautiful leg kick lands. Final seconds of the round. And that'll do it. 15 minutes in the books. All right, well, if you like blood, and I do, this is the fight for you. Somehow we've made it to the stools, and both fighters are wearing it. Yeah, I mean, the corner's going to have some work to do on that cut. He has been beat up in that round, but he has done his fair share of damage himself. This has been a very close fight. All right, let us now get you some replays of all the damage done in that previous round, including the strike that opened up the cut. Yeah, some nasty strikes landed over the course of that round, and it opened up a nasty cut. He has got to find a way to change some things defensively, or that cut is just going to get worse and worse. And the worse it gets, the more he runs the risk of this fight getting stopped. You ready to fight? Ready. Yeah. Fourth round. Fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. All right, the action continues here and now as our next round gets underway. And, man, these guys still look fresh as if they haven't even started fighting tonight. Pretty impressive. Both of them have a huge reputation for being fit fighters. And it shows in the way they're approaching round number two. Man, that cut is so bad, you wonder if at some point that is going to start to affect his breathing. Back to the leg kick now. That one's no good.
The right hand just misses. Lee's really bleeding now. That cut is only getting worse. And that one certainly found the target. Massive body kick land. Oh, solid kicks are landing. He has most certainly found the range on the feet. Well, these gentlemen are absolutely going at it. Let's see who'll have the upper hand. Well, this fight has been absolutely crazy. Both fighters continuing to target the head and the face of the other. I feel like we're going to get, like, an ambulance pick with these two guys later. Tonight. Yeah, they are both beat up. They are both unwilling to take a step back. They are both wearing the damage, but both okay with it in order to have a good, fun fight. Lee's nose is absolutely mangled at this stage of the fight. I'm no doctor, but I feel pretty convicted in saying that thing is definitely broken. And we might get a ringside physician or a referee to stop this fight here soon. Just over three minutes to go. Oh, that is as big a strike as he has landed thus far tonight. Big, massive shot lands. Look at how tough his opponent is, though. Still standing, still in their fight. Shot to the body. They're really starting to connect at a high percentage now in the latter stages. Oh, I think he's still compromised. We'll see if he can recover here. He's in a world of trouble. This is crazy round of fight. Oh, and it another knee there. DC doesn't always pay to be the taller fighter. In this instance, it most certainly did. All right, so the blood continues to be a major factor in this fight. And I think at some point the referee is going to intervene here, DC. He hasn't been able to change anything, right? So it doesn't, we have no indication that he's going to be able to stay in this fight. The cut was open very early. Now we're at a point where it's going to be stopped due to all the blood and how limited he is in trying to stay in this fight. Lee's an absolute mess. I wonder if they might call in the ringside physician and potentially stop this fight. a beautiful leg kick. 90 seconds to go. Look to the headlands, flush there by Lee. Oh, nice technique on the side kick. You don't learn that overnight. They continue to exchange. Big shot to the head. Under a minute to go in the round. It's work. Beautiful shot to the leg. Oh, a huge strike lands there, DC landed that massive shot. Now he needs to try to find the next shot, the follow-up shot, that will finish the fight. 30 in the round. Oh, and that kick is blocked. Keep 20 seconds left. Oh, the Superman punch lands. 10 seconds to go in the round. his takedown attempt of choice and it works out for him. Absolutely, he is comfortable, he is home when he's in on a single leg. All right, so we're gonna take a look back at some of the replays that caused all of this damage in that previous round. These guys were going back and forth, both throwing real heavy strikes that really did a lot of damage to their opponent. It's an evenly matched fight, but one of them has to separate themselves if they're gonna get the victory. All right, so the cut men have done their work let us see who can survive as we get ready to start. What could be our final round here tonight? There's a lot of blood. The cuts are open good. Brett wants to stop this fight, but you're not going to let him.
go back out there. You ready to fight? Ready. Good. It is the fifth and final round. Oh, nice check on the leg kick offering there. Just out of range with the big right hand. Oh! Oh, head kick gets home. Don't want to take too many of those. Oh, and he tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Lee. I'm not sure how he stayed up there. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, to stay standing shows and talks to your toughness. Big right hand there. Oh, back and forth we go. Blood is everywhere. I'm just not sure how much one man can take. Never mind both of these guys absorbing a ton of damage. Yeah, John, they're spraying blood all over each other. They're beating each other up. They are in each other's face. They are really showing you what type of heart you need in order to be a fighter. What a performance by both. Very rarely do you gain in losing. But whoever loses this fight will be able to leave this octagon with their head held high. Lee's really targeting that cut right now, and why not? He has opened up his opponent. Might as well continue to attack that particular area. Huge knee land. Grips the body there. Another hook lands there by Lee. Went for the inside leg kick. Oh, perfectly done as he gets the takedown. Hardy's right, trying to control posture here. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. Look at that. Recognize he's about to lose position. Oh, another blow lands on the cut. Critical situation now. He's a bloody mess. Posture's up now and lands a devastating strike to the head. He's just being more aggressive, and because he's being more aggressive and more loose with his strikes, he's landing. Drops down inside the now closed guard of his opponent. Let's see how patient he is as he attacks a submission or big ground and pop. Oh, he reversed position there on the ground, and he's now in the dominant position. All right, working out of side control here. His opponent trying to control posture, but you got to be careful here. All the ground and pound strikes continue to rain down. The opponent better move out of harm's way or the referee's gonna stop. All right, so he gets back to the feet. That was seemingly the only way he could win this fight. Down the stretch we come. Down the stretch, but on the feet, he was not going to win this fight from his back. He needed to get up. That was step number one. Step two, find the finish. If you're gonna go out, go out on your shield. If you're going out, go out on your shield. Don't just walk backwards. Go forward. Make it fight. Oh, what a hit kick there as he lands, and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. What an absolute war it has been. Probably going to hold up in the fight of the year conversation, and I wouldn't be surprised to see both fighters at the hospital later tonight. It just takes me back to certain fights. It takes me back to Michael Johnson against Justin Gaethje. Justin Gaethje versus Michael Chandler. Michael Chandler versus Dustin Poirier. The best fights in the world is what I think about when I look at these two. From the blood, from the damage, to the heart and the spirit that these two have shown. I cannot believe that these guys have made it to a minute left in the fight with that type of ability. All right, 45 seconds now to go on the round. Oh, strong hook to the head there by Lee. All right, so the ref is going to step in here and call on the doctor to look at what is a now mangled nose. This could be the end of the fight. It could be the end of the fight. There's a lot of blood. The blood's going down into the mouth. I mean, the nose could be broken. 
Crowd wants the fight to continue, and it looks as though it will, but maybe stylistically might have to change some things and get aggressive because that cut's not getting any better. That cut is only going to get worse. Every right. time you get hit in it, right. it just gets worse and right. worse. He's going to have to take some chances, try to end this fight right now. All right, well, this fighter was bullish in his desire to continue, and the doctor is going to afford him that opportunity as the referee gets us back underway. This guy's a fighter, man. This guy doesn't want to lose a fight on the stool. He wants an opportunity to go out there and go out on the shield. And that's exactly what he's getting. He's getting a chance. And as a fighter, that's all you can ask for. And you know fans don't like doctor stoppages, so they are thrilled. They start booing. And sometimes, guys, eye is hanging off the side of his head. Cards, one of the greatest fights that we have seen all year. We'll see how the judges saw it. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score this contest. 49-46. Declaring the winner by unanimous decision, LT Gray. All right, congratulations to him. He is your winner by unanimous decision and certainly a dominant performance here tonight. Yeah, he did a great job of just dictating and controlling all the engagements of this fight. His opponent never really had an opportunity to lead the dance. He did that from start to finish.